Good morning. It is early afternoon, Saturday, 11 20, 2021. And I was just going to share with you last night I was getting my journals out here and I was organizing them in date order from 2018 to current. And I, one of the last entries that I had looked at last night before I went to bed was. Um, in 2019 and it was regarding these journals and it was um, also regarding bachelor number one and what God had revealed to me in 2018 December 2018 that he was my true love and or first of all true night and true love and that um, so this journal entry pretty much it it had revealed that um, the journals would be opened up uh, to to bachelor number one. So anyway, so that was the last entry that I had read before I went to bed last night and this morning I opened my Bible at random and um, It opens to this Chapter these chapters here in Amos. It's Amos chapter 5 and 6 and it has a star here and as you know if you've been watching my channels earlier on um, I was writing the promises God had given me for my true love revealed in two, December 2018 on stars and so anyway there's a number of these stars in my Bible uh, tucked in here and literally this is just was at random in where it was even placed and so I open it up this morning and it's the same journal entry that I read last night before I went to bed and I don't know about you, but um, the, you, the Word of God is inspired, and so there's a lot of times you can you just open it up at random, and it will God will speak to you through the Word um, at the very in up time. You know, I don't know in up time. I don't know if that's the right word or not. But anyway, so I thought I would share with you this this writing here. Um, and what it says is, um, I'll put, put the focus on the journals here so I can read this. Um, so it's 11, 23, 19 and God thoughts visual and the books journals were opened unto blue that he may see the treasures I have placed within your heart so he will be moved in heart as well to complete the task I have put before thee my thoughts yes Lord I will love that I have pictured him um, reading through my journals and the writings ideas thoughts you have blessed me with God thoughts Blue is my blessing to you as your helpmate, true knight, and true love. As earthlings follow in my lead, will and purpose for your lives, living, breathing, and having your being in and through me, fulfilling your destiny I have laid out before you. So run, skip, and fly. As I have shared before on the wings of my love for the two of you together in him and there's a song actually that's called together in him and I think it may be on this channel and um, I, I'm not a very good singer but I sang that song because it, it was actually hard to find on YouTube um, when I first was looking for it Anyway, so um, then my thoughts, thank you, Lord, praising you for my Father and God. Thank you for creating us. So um, anyway, I just thought I would share that with you and also that it just happens to be that where this um, opened up to into Amos chapter 5 and 6, um, the titles says, Israel's Various Sins and Call to Repentance. And I, I thought about reading this to you, but 
you know, God's word is inspired and he really wants us to draw close to him and to seek him with all our heart, might, and soul. And so I encourage you to go to Amos chapter 5 and 6 of Amos and read it because it is amazing in the timing of this star being here in this book. And I, it, I just placed it at random. I have other stars in here. Um, at different places that just are at random, except for maybe in Proverbs uh, 31, I don't know, you know, for kingdom marriages. But anyway, um, huh, I just wanted to share that with you. Um, oh, so about this chapter, it's amazing to me just what's going on in the world and what it says in these two chapters. And I ended up reading it actually all the way to the end. Um, and and what's happening not just in the world but even in my own personal life with the the drawings and the art that God has um, revealed and the writings um, he has given me and through prayer writing you know here it talks about the the sea and the, and and it talks about the stars in here and um, and the vision too that I have um, it's it's on this site. Um, there's a picture of a cloud with the running man. Um, and that vision is similar to what this says to you in this, these chapters here. So I just really do encourage you to look up um, and read it for yourself because it's so much more powerful if you yourself go in there and read it, I believe, than me reading it to you. So... Um, Anyway, I just want to share that with you, and you guys have a great, great weekend, a great, great day, and uh, God bless, and if you're not journaling already, I encourage you to go get a journal, and I've shared before, you know, the nicer the journal, the more you enjoy writing in it, um, and I know some of these here, I just <laughs> grabbed what I could, but anyway, um, just encourage you to draw near to God, start journaling, even writing your prayers out and being quiet before the Lord and see what, you know, ask for God to clear your thoughts of all other people's thoughts, your thoughts, the enemy's thoughts, and just to filter to you just his thoughts that he has for you, his thoughts, his will, his purpose for your life. And it'll be amazing if you can be in a quiet place with the, the pen in hand and your journal pages opened to the flow of thought that God will put into your um, your thoughts, you know, if, if you've secured your heart before him and you have, um, if any sins that you need to ask forgiveness for, you know, you've aligned your heart right with God and then pray that prayer that he would just filter to you his thoughts only, purpose and will in your life. And, of course, anything that you write down, just don't even think about it, just as, it, as the words come into thought you just write them down and then go back later after you're done and write read it and if it doesn't match up to the word of God the character of God um you know um good I mean if there's any darkness or anything that doesn't match up to God's word or the character of God then it's most likely not of God but um you'll be amazed you know what God will reveal to you if you would just take the time to spend with him and draw near to him um, he will reveal and he will make himself real and if if you need to pray even yourself if you're having a hard time with God making himself real just pray cry out to him and say Lord please make yourself real to me in my life and he will like he said draw near to me and he will draw near to you so anyway God bless and take care and enjoy your day and um Get a journal. Get a journal. It's great. It's so great to communicate with your maker, okay? And know his thoughts for you. Awesome. Okay, God bless. Okay, bye.